Ladies and gentlemen, the time has arrived for another comment reading video. I was planning on doing skincare for midweek this week, but I'm on vacation and uh, yeah, I just felt like doing something funny. I went to the dentist today, my teeth hurt, you know, because they, like, they get in there with that floss, like just like it's the last time you're ever going to floss in your life. So, you know, my, my, my teeth are hurting, they need a little pick me up, and so I wanted to do something to give myself and hopefully you guys a good chuckle. So, cheers. I just hit myself in the nose with a glass. I promise I haven't had that many beers. So, this is the like janky edition too, because I don't even, I left my laptop at work like a dum dum. So, I'm going to be reading them from my phone. Mm. All right, here we go. Let's get started. You're a faggot. Ooh, Erun. Erun? Erun? A A Ron? No, there's, there's only one A. Starting out spicy though. Is that, I mean, but like, is that really supposed to bother me? Like, is that, I don't know. Do you really think that that's like a jab? Or, or, or is that just like wishful thinking? Well, his content is much better than yours. This is in reference to, um, I just had like a total brain fart. Uh, <laughs> teaching men's fashion after that, you know the video. Um, is it though? Is it better than mine? My, can I? Okay. Are you sure? <sighs> Seems you are a great sponsor of the Saloon Guy. Saloon Guy. Saloon Guy. Also, I, I find it's interesting that this guy thinks that I'm the sponsor now. I'm not sponsored by him anymore. Uh, I'm now the sponsor, so I'm paying him to, to say things about his products. Is that how it works now? Is that is that like the new shit? Head ass with the purple hair. That's I. <laughs> I kind of like that comment. I don't know. It has a nice ring to it. I do got some purple hair though. What you want? Probably sponsored by Cluth. Cluth. Yeah, you know that Cluth clay. It's really good. Now, all right. So we've gone from me being sponsored to me sponsoring him to me being sponsored by an inanimate object. So we're progressing, we're progressing. Shave your underarms. I, no, maybe, I don't know. I mean, like, I'm not opposed to like trimming it up, I guess, but then it's just gonna fucking, it's just more upkeep, dude. Just like blow dry it upside down. This was from my, so, so Stranger Things came back. It's season three of Stranger Things now. And like the past, so I, a long fucking time ago, like after season one of Stranger Things was around, I did a, uh, tutorial video on how to do Steve Harrington's hair. Um, which, I mean, that was, that was before I really like came into my own and like started, you know, injecting some humor into my content and stuff. So it, I mean, it's a little fucky, like it's fine. It, it, it's not terrible, but every like new season of Stranger Things, that video starts getting popular again. And I get like a whole new slew of comments, um, ranging from good things to stuff like this. So, so, so. Just, I mean, he, like, he's not wrong, dude. I should've just blow dried it upside, that's the whole tutorial. Just, just upside down, blow dry, done. I could've made that video 30 seconds long. Man, your hair is already too much damaged. Is it though, bitch? Is it? Look at this fucking shit. It looks so good, even in this shitty bar lighting. My shit looks fleek, trying to tell me damaged boy nothing like don draper at all yeah nothing nothing like it it's totally different this is not at all like that hairstyle total, total mistake. looks nothing like his hair you just look like a fucking faggot i mean is that really that's it that's all you got that 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 just you could have you could have done better man I expected more from you. Gay. Don't know why I said that. Bitch, you know why you said it. Trying to play me. Come on, son. Come Good boy, son. You are good. What in the goddamn does that mean? I honestly don't know. Even your name doesn't make sense. I don't. I'm at a loss on that one. Wow, you played yourself. This. <laughs> 
can't, I can't take that comment seriously with that fucking icon. With, with <laughs> God damn, man, you ugly. Objection! Ew, no, bitch. Yes. Come on, I don't even know what. What my fuck? My fucking coaster keeps sticking to my glass. Come on, trash. You know, Jake, that's pretty funny. Coming from a guy whose icon is a picture of him sitting on a fucking dumpster! Is that where you got those rubber ducky shorts, dude? Did you pull them straight out of that fucking dumpster and put them on? Or are you going to like a pool party with your socks and shoes on like a fucking sociopath? Are you able to use this as anal lubricant? Um, yeah, so that was on that Old Spice budget stuff video. That's all, oh, I just got it. I just got it. That's pretty funny because budget stuff sounds like butt stuff, anal lubricant, you know? That was good. That was good. I like that. Um, I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't recommend that though. It, it would, you might, it might burn a little bit. That was gross. I mean, come on, son. I, it's not, it's not that gross. It's not great. I'm the first to admit that. That video was before the greatness that my videos are now. That sounds really cocky. I don't care. My videos are much better now than they used to be. Stand by. Two seconds. <sighs> Oh god, I just fucking got beer everywhere. Oh, for this fucking coaster, I swear to Christ. Oh, please don't go over the top. So for any of you who are cringing at this pour and you think I should have tilted the glass more, I learned something from a super snooty beer sommelier video uh, where you're actually apparently supposed to pour beer with a bit of vigor so that you develop a pretty good head because that foam lets go of some of the CO2 so then you get less bloated when you drink it. Mm. I just need to drink some, I think. Okay, back to business. This guy really thinks that's wavy hair. <laughs> Bitch, my hair is wavy. <laughs> Literally watch any of my... Actually, I should probably show <laughs> my wavy hair a little bit more so that people don't think that I'm lying. But like, bitch, it's fucking... I blow it out all the time. Of course it doesn't look that wavy at the finished product. What about Salon Guy, huh? Salon Guy is not that good, which you tell on your review. Yeah, I fucking downvoted your ass. I, you know, this is just one of those, people like wonder like, oh, why do you get so defensive? Cause like, I don't know, fucking people like certain brands and brands work well for certain people. And for me, the Salon Guys products work great. And so, yeah, I give them good reviews cause I like them, like actually like them. And you know, this these type of comments just fucking get stale, man. So, you know, you leave them, I'm gonna fucking downvote you. I'll take that. Is that really it? Shit. No. Uh -huh. I guess that was the last one. That's a shame. I thought I had more than that, but that's okay. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I always really, really enjoy making these. I love like editing them, which is, it, it's a weird process. Cause like filming them and like for the first couple hours worth of editing, I'm like watching it and I'm like, this is not gonna be funny at all. This is terrible. No one's gonna like it. But then the finished product comes out and I'm usually happy with it. So <laughs> thanks for watching. Thanks for coming on by. Uh, stick around for this weekend. I am doing budget stuff episode three and the crowd has spoken in my community tab. So this week we are looking at three of the four stylers from Axe and I'm sure it's gonna be an interesting time so be sure to stick around for that if you haven't already please do hit that subscribe button down below to keep up to date with everything and as always thank you guys so much for coming by and watching and we'll see you at the next one cheers <laughs>